woke up today feeling really good. I had no headaches, I had no back pain. Instead of yogurt and chopped up fruit and nuts, I'm actually gonna have a smoothie. It's really important to have a bit of variety in this diet, so yeah, let's make a smoothie. And so it is the end of day eight and I have a cup of peppermint tea to finish the day. I've had a quite a positive day and for dinner I decided to change things up. I decided to turn the steamed veggies into a broth, a vegetable soup, all the added water and the extra few ingredients. It ended up being not just one meal but five or six even meals dependent on your portion size. So yeah, all is well. And yeah, bring on day nine. So it is day nine and generally I'm feeling pretty good. The food that I am eating is nicely nutritional and yeah, so breakfast time awaits. I think it's smoothie time, so let's make the smoothie. That's enough for a breakfast and also a nice snack in the early afternoon. So it is day nine and it is just after 4.30 when I'm having the second glass of this smoothie that I made. So it's now what to have for dinner. So as we're on a budget, I was initially gonna have salmon on day nine and 10, but salmon is pretty expensive. So what I thought I would do is look for something a little bit different. And what I found was some sardines. I found them nicely whole and nicely fresh. I found a recipe online and yeah, let's see how we go. It's um, yeah, always good to try something new. The salmon was about $24 a kilo and the sardines, they were only $5.50 a kilo. So I got 10 sardines for $2.02 .02, and I got one piece of salmon for $5.34. So let's see what we can do. Let's see what I can make. And uh, yeah, I've got to get the guts out. So that's the first challenge.
it is day 10 of day 10 and yeah wow how did the time just go by today is the final day and I last night had some sardines totally affordable and they were delicious feeling full of energy I'm feeling heaps better and it's kind of reset my whole system so I'll see you guys for breakfast It is the end of day 10. I have made it and the days are done. What I thought I'd do is tomorrow morning I would weigh myself first thing and then I would also give you guys a bit of an overview, my thoughts, my views of the whole 10 days. It is the end of the 10 day fast slash food reboot thingamy thing that I've been doing and yeah gosh I cannot believe it is done. Firstly let's talk about weight loss and so when I first started I was 79.3 kilos. When I finished the three day fast I was at 76.2. And then when I finished the 10 days, I wondered if I would regain some of the weight, but I actually went down to a 76 kilo straight weight loss. There's a total weight loss of 3.3 kilos in 10 days. Number one thing that I would say that is the hardest is not the headaches or the tiredness because it differs depending on what your diet has been before but I would say you really need to dedicate all of your energy the headaches and the exhaustion all that kind of thing was particularly in the first three days and the thing about this two or three day water fast it really gives you time to stop and to be still and then follow that on with these seven days of slowly increasing foods into my diet from the bone broth to the fruit and the probiotic rich yogurt and you know bananas and avocados and by the end of these 10 days I felt stronger and stronger now at the end of this I feel really healthy and I feel calm energized I feel like I've achieved a lot and you know I can continue moving forward with my system sort of realigned I guess you could say my system is used to you know really healthy food it's not had any carbohydrates or any caffeine or any alcohol and my diet has been pretty clean the food has not been highly processed the challenge now is how do I move forward, continue with the benefits that I got. The most important thing is that I drink enough water, that my portion size stays small. Staying active, going for a walk, having my cold showers, and I might every once in a while make a bone broth. We are done with this video. I would love to know what you think of this 10 day total body revamp rejuvenation journey that I've been on if it has helped you if you've decided to do a three-day fast if it's inspired you to do a three-day water fast if you decided to follow these 10 days and do it yourself 
if you have any questions or comments about how I did it or what I did, the choices I made. If you want to get a full list of the food plan, please let me know. And yeah, please comment below on all your thoughts and your questions. Apart from that, please subscribe to this channel and you can keep checking back and find out the various videos I put up. So yeah, here's to a healthy, healthy, healthy life and uh, full of inspiring new things that we all are trying to do. And yeah, lots of love everybody. See you in the next video.